Hello, my name is Stanley Hoffman. Today I have with me Chad Miller, who is the author of the book Major Lessons for Minors. How are you this morning, Chad? Good. Good. It's nice, a pleasure nice to be to here. Have you. Thank you. Um, I'm, I'm just going to get right to the right to this, Chad. What is the focus of your book? What What is it about? Well, the book is about 68 real-life lessons to help young adults make smart decisions when they get out of high school. Uh, not just the stuff they teach in high school, but actual real-life things they'll be dealing with on a daily basis. Uh, which I've, I think that's terrific. I've had countless conversations with people about the fact that they need to teach life skills in school. Kids come out of school, they don't know how to fill out a resume. They don't know how to balance a checkbook. There are so many things that just aren't addressed in school that it's, it's almost criminal. Absolutely. Uh, and I th So I, my congratulations to you. I admire that you're doing it. What motivated you to do this? What took you in the direction to do this? Well, I have a background in real estate. I'm a realtor by trade, and I've done a tremendous amount of business in the past eight years in real estate, but I've also met a lot of people, both younger and older, that don't really have a good understanding of how the real world works. That's why I wrote this book, just to kind of give them a simple refer reference guide so they can look through the book and understand how real things work when they encounter them in, the, in real life. Uh that's terrific. You know, and I notice. I want to say something that's just a matter of opinion. You're obviously a, a really, really sharp, uh, well-spoken young man. You're a terrific role model. Well, thank you for kids to to look up to. So, thank you. Uh, I'm really glad that you're here. Is this your first book? Yeah, this is my first book. It took me three years to write it, just because I wanted to make sure it had great content and was very simple to read. So it took me three years, then a whole other you know six months to proofread it and put it together. But I'm really proud of this. I'm really passionate about it, and I want to make sure that everybody has an opportunity to get this for themselves or their kids. Okay. Let me ask you this: If there were, what are some of the, a couple of the most important lessons? Uh, that if you were to say, if, if you could only take this out of this book, this is what I, I think is the, is the most valuable thing in you. Well, one of, one of the lessons that has helped me in my business and my career is probably the lesson about business, which says that you should always give your customers more value than the income you receive from them. It essentially says you should always do a better job than what you're paid. And if you take that into your business, you will always be successful. You'll always have people talking about you and giving you referrals. And that's kind of one of the most important lessons in this book among the 67 others. That's quite a bit of lessons. Oh, good, good stuff. <laughs> so, so it sounds like something you could not just read, but then refer back to, refer to, refer to, refer to as you encounter exactly. different situations in your life. Is it, that right? Exactly. I don't expect everybody to remember all of these lessons, but as you come across them in life, it's an easy reference. So you can just flip the page, read some blurb about it, and, and really get a good idea on what decision to make so that you keep your money in your pocket. How would you say that, that your book compares to the uh, basic high school curriculum? Um, well, I, I went to one of the best high schools in the country in the Midwest. It was a blue ribbon school and it was a great school, but they taught me almost nothing about real life lessons and things that I'm going to have to deal with. So I made a lot of costly mistakes and I think that high schoolers should have a lot more information like this that they have access to because a lot of the, the history and things that they teach in high school don't really have an, a hands-on application in the real world. So that's one of the reasons I wrote this book is to give high schoolers that extra reference guides that can really help them uh, make smart decisions. You mentioned the Midwest. Where are you from? Missouri, Springfield, Missouri. I'm a St. Louis boy. Oh yeah, good old Missouri. <laughs> and I, when you when you mentioned the Midwest, and, I, and not to just brag about Midwesterners, but being from the, the heartland of the country, you do seem to come up with a, a different set of values than uh, than other places. So, and I'm I'm guessing that that's reflected. Absolutely. In your book and how you run your life. Am I right? Absolutely. Absolutely. Like in business especially, the way you treat people and the way you go out of your way to help others before you help your, yourself. And that's kind of the, one another lesson in here and uh, something I, I kind of learned from the Pride Midwest. yourself on? Yeah. Let me ask you, so where, I'm assuming, and maybe I'm incorrect, these lessons, uh, just who, do, who taught you these values, these lessons? What, where did, what was your role model? Well, my parents taught me some very good lessons, but they also made some very good mistakes that I learned from. And I've made a lot of mistakes on my own that have cost me quite a bit of money. 
But you know, you always pay for that education, whether you pay more for it or less for it. And that's that's why this book is out there to kind of help you avoid paying big money and costly mistakes. You know, so that you can make smart decisions. That's fantastic. You should be proud of that. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. I very. I, I really am. And. I think it's a, a great legacy to be able to leave your children, which we haven't really talked about. But are, are, are you married? Do you have kids? Yeah, I've been married for six years. I have a little two and a half year old at home. I'm a stay at home dad as well, which I do oh, full time as, as well as sell the book and, and do real estate also. And uh, just a little bit about me, if you have a minute. Um, you know, I'm a, a real estate agent by trade. I've sold over $25 million worth of real estate in the past eight years. I've flipped over 250 homes in my career. So I've had tremendous success. And through that experience, I've, I've really learned a lot of these lessons that I can be applied in this book. Well, that's interesting because that kind of takes me to my next question. And I hope this doesn't sound demeaning in any way. But because you are young, my first thought was, and I'm just being honest, what makes you feel that you're qualified to, to offer this kind of advice to people who are like sponges and they, and they need all the help that they can get. Yeah, absolutely, that's a good question. Well, you know, I've, I've been through all of these lessons myself. I have experience in every single thing, whether I've did it, done it correctly or incorrectly. I just have a lot of experience and I've, I've got a really good head on my shoulders when it comes to dealing with these things. And besides my past experience, of course, in real estate and, and making a lot of money and a lot of smart decisions. So I just, I've been through it personally and I've, kind of have to know how everything works and how everything can be done com you know, successfully. So that's, that's what kind of makes me qualified. And I, I want to say too, uh, from having done a little bit of the uh, at-home dad thing, there's a certain amount of values and that come with that and a certain amount of seeing the world differently. Right. Uh, respect for your spouse, for one thing, is, is a, a gigantic thing, and respect for how difficult parenting is Absolutely. Uh, for another thing. So I admire you for that. Do you have any other plans to write anything else? Yeah, I have a few other books that are uh, on the way in the next six months to a year. Um, one book in particular I wanted to get into how to uh, successfully run a business while you're working with Facebook, oh, and boy. a few other things that uh, people are really struggling with right now that I kind of have a knack on. So yeah, do expect more books from me in the future. Where, you, you're obviously educated. Where'd you go to school? Uh, Florida Atlantic University. I have a business degree, a bachelor degree in business at FAU. We have uh, several people with our company down in Boca Raton mm -hmm. uh, that are all Florida Atlantic people. So yeah, that's uh, where I that's obviously where I went to producing school. excellent students out of uh, uh, FAU. Congratulations. Oh, yes. Thank you. Let me ask you, what, what's your book sell for? Well, the paperback you can buy for nine ninety nine, and the ebook version you can get for four ninety nine. I made it really cheap and accessible, so everybody can uh, can buy it. And Four ninety nine. I mean, it's the same amount as a cup of coffee at Starbucks. You can buy a book that is that will save you or your kids thousands of dollars in the future. That's that's terrific. We're only down to a couple minutes left, so I want to make sure that people have uh, every opportunity to get a hold of you to, to purchase this book because I think it's something anybody with a family should have. Anybody with kids Absolutely. should get it for your kids. I I'm, I'm totally convinced of that. How do people get a hold of you? Well, the best way is online. So if you go to my website, MajorLifeLessons.com, that's MajorLifeLessons.com, you can buy the book right from my site. You can download the uh, the ebook version. And you can also send this copy signed by me as a gift. So you just enter in the address of the gift recipient, and I'll sign it and send it right over. Terrific. We're probably down to about a minute left. And in that last minute, I'd like you to do something for me. Just for the viewers, one thing about you, one thing about you and your philosophy that you want to share with people, what's the most important thing to you? Well, in my career, and I haven't had a long career, but I've had tremendous success, I figured out that no matter what profession you're in, no matter what you do, all of the most successful, the wealthiest people have one thing in common. It's not confidence, it's not smarts, it's not any of that, those personal traits. It's the ability to make smart decisions. Smart decisions is the key to being successful at anything. If you make dumb decisions, it doesn't matter how smart you are, how good looking you are, or how you know, much backing you have, you're not gonna be successful. And that's the one thing that I, I wanna promote with this book. Absolutely outstanding. Chad, it's been a, a real, real pleasure. This is Chad Miller. The name of the book is Major Lessons for Minors. I hope you get yours soon. This is Stanley Hoffman. Have a great day.